Hi, this is an unboxing and review of the Mocreo Mo Sound Drips. Basically, what this is is an IP54 waterproof Bluetooth speaker. You can use it to listen to music and make hand free phone call. It comes in a box like this. Just a simple white box, so let's go ahead and unbox it. Inside, you can see immediately is the unit itself. So let's go ahead and take it out. Underneath, you have a little keychain that you can hook it up to. And at the bottom here, a micro USB charging cable, auxiliary cable, and a user menu. Here's the user menu itself, with a small little page here. Has some instruction how to set it up here at the bottom. Pretty easy step-by-step -step instruction here. Inside you have a little bit more information about the unit, how to charge it, how to use some of the operating mode. And then in the back here you have information regarding the specification of the speaker. Look like it's a 3 watt input. You have a 500 milliamp battery. Look like 4 hour of playback time. Look like it support a micro SD card of 16 gigabyte and waterproof here. And then some inf other information. So here's the speaker itself. Make out this very soft silicone. And this nice little hole that goes around it. Top here you have the Mocreo logo. And this is also very soft plastic. Look like the sound is coming up top here. This is also look like soft plastic. You got a place here where you can use that hook earlier. Actually, this whole thing feels like hard plastic right here. On the side here, you have the flap for the micro SD card, the USB port for charging, and also the auxiliary input, the line in right here. So you can see right here. So this whole thing is covered for waterproof reason. On the other side of the speaker, you have this button here, which are, you can feel I can press them. Basically, you have the, uh, look like the volume up, volume down, and fast forward and rewind. And you have the pause and play, and also, you also have the answer call, which is multi-function all built into here. This design is very nice and I really like this uh, texture feeling. It looks like almost like a rock and it feels really nice, soft in your hands. The bottom is very soft and here's the power button and then the mode button to switch between the different mode. So let's go ahead and turn it on and pair it with my phone. Hold out the power button here for two seconds. Has this really nice blue ring at the bottom. I'm ready, waiting for a connection. Oh, I speak to you, okay. Very nice. Go ahead and turn on Bluetooth with my phone. Look like I'm seeing a new device called Mo Drift, Mo Sound Drips. So go ahead and connect to it. Bluetooth connected. There you go. I really like the speaking to let you know the different status. That's really nice. I'm gonna play a uh, YouTube video from my one of my channel. Hi, this is an unboxing and review. So there's the volume. It's on low right now. I'm gonna set it all the way up. This is a very high DPI mount. This is up to 8200 DPI. It's really, loud. really nice box like this. This mount features the Avango 9800. I'm also going to play a song here. It's a short song to, to show you. I don't want to play too long for copyright reason. Can I give you an idea? Pretty loud. So I have a micro SD card in here now. I'm just going to switch the mode. It doesn't look like when I put it in, it automatically switch. So when I press the mode switch. Enjoy card music. It's saying enjoy card music. So it's probably going to try to play a song here for my card. I'm going to go ahead and fast forward. See, you can hear the song and pause it. Resume. Next song. As you can see, let me try to fast forward the song. Volume up. Use the people volume down by holding it down. So to switch the song, you just press the two button here. And to go volume up, volume down, you're just pressing this button and the pause right here. So there's no way to really fast forward in a song. You can only fast forward to the next or rewind to the previous song. So I have my phone still connected here and the song is still playing and I pause it. I can resume the song by pressing this button here. See? No problem. So currently you have the Bluetooth speaker plugged in using the auxiliary cable. Go ahead and turn it on. I'm ready, waiting for a connection. So it's trying to look for a Bluetooth connection. I'm gonna go ahead and hit the more button. Enjoy aux music. See, you can hear it say enjoy aux music. So it's in aux mode right now. Go ahead and press play on my phone here. And charging on the iPod, iPad, and iPhone. The cable will come in a package like this. So the auxiliary cable works really well as you can see. And you can use this for any device that does not have a Bluetooth transmitting capability. So overall, the Mocreo Mo Sound Drips work really well. 
I love this speaker. I love the way it looks. It's really nice, especially with the lighting off. It looks really nice. Let me show you. So with the light turn off, it looks really nice. And it feels really good in the hand. I love the little clip that you can use to clip to your side. The speaker is designed for some waterproof, so which means if it's raining, you are able to handle that. I wouldn't, you know, dip just in the, the water completely. I don't think they will flow at all and it will probably break. But, uh, you know, as far as having a little bit of water on it, it should work fine. Sound quality wise, it's pretty good. For the lower range, you have a decent amount of bass. It's, uh, it's there, it's present, especially when you put it on a flat surface like this table. You do get a little bit of vibration, but it's, you know, it's not a massive amount of bass. The mid range on these sound really good. So when I'm listening to a phone call, or when I'm listening to some, you know, some music, some jazz music, those kind of thing, top 40 music, it sounds pretty good. The high is not so good. It's, uh, it's very pitchy from some time to time. The volume does get really loud. But you know, at the really high end of the volume, uh, you might have some issues with some song that's you know very string based. You might get some really pitchy noise out of that. But other than that, as a consumer product for using for everyday listening to music and uh, answering phone call, this device works really well. When I'm speaking to someone on the phone using this Bluetooth speaker, they didn't report any echo or anything like that. However, if you're outside and uh, there's a lot of wind, this thing will pick it up. So you'll pick up when there's no noise cancellation. If you're looking for a unique speaker with some waterproof ability, this is a really nice choice. I really love the way the voice talks to you and let you know what the status of the speaker so you don't have to guess. And when it's connected, you get this nice blue light here. The only downside I can think of is that they say it takes four hours to charge it and you only get four hour playtime. And that is actually true. It doesn't actually take four hours. It takes a little bit less than that, but it does take a while to charge, and you only get four hour play time. So that's the only downside. I wish it was a little bit longer in battery life, maybe you know six to eight hour. It's a pretty big unit. It's not like a tiny unit here. So you can see my medium size hand. So I wish the battery in here was a little bit bigger. As far as playing back from the micro SD card, it does not support any fancy format like flat or anything. It seemed to play MP3 fine, and that's about it. I didn't try any window media file because I don't have any window media audio, but I have mostly MP3 and flock, and the flock doesn't play on here, just the MP3. I hope this review has been helpful for you in your purchase decision. If you have any questions, please let me know in the comment below. And as always, stay tuned for future review. Thank you.